thank you so much for clicking on this video. Today I did something a little different. I almost never wear my hair natural or like straighten my natural hair. The last time I did this was actually in March. Um, it's not a year yet, three months till it's a year, but um, I'm basically doing a check-in like I straightened and trimmed my hair last March. I talk more in the actual video so I'm gonna get right to that because I don't like when my intros are too long. Make sure you hit that subscribe button, press that like to help with the algorithm, and yeah, let's get into it. This is as good as my hair is gonna get. I can't wait to put some heat on it. Listen, I'm trying to be consistent. This today's just not my day already. It's just not, it's not my day, but I'm gonna make it my day. For those of y'all who <clears throat> don't know, this is my hair texture. It's changed, it's evolved over the years. Tomorrow I'm actually filming a very like cool campaign and I decided, you know what, why don't you straighten your natural hair? Why not take a risk last minute when you have a very special day tomorrow, you know? Because we just love that thrill of maybe it'll look good, maybe it won't look good, who knows? If it looks bad, I can honestly just plop a wig on. Shout out to wigs, you know, even though my edges are suffering in the slightest. My natural hair, we have a weird relationship. So I'm basically gonna start detangling it from the bottom up. I washed my hair last night and I dyed it black. So this is really just freshly washed, freshly dyed hair and I'm gonna do the chasing method. I haven't done this in a while. Okay, 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 okay. Yo. Ah! So yeah, like I was saying, I feel like every black girl literally has a horrible relationship with the straightener you know in middle school high school i'm talking about girls who didn't grow up with social media so like 96 i'm 96 1996 and basically i'm talking about 90s babies okay when this whole movement of natural hair wasn't around so i wasn't taught to embrace my natural hair at that point or gelling my hair i literally found out about slicking my hair when i was in university like it was just me and this straightener right here like this i never wanted to be without it it was my lucky charm you know my go-to i would just have my clip-in extensions and ow Okay, I'm seeing some growth. I had no regard for my hair. I did not care. I, did, I just wanted to look good. And in my head, straight hair was, you know, how to achieve that look. You know, I wanted hair that moved. I wanted to do this with my hair, you know? You know what I'm talking about? I definitely had my phase with the straightener and that's why I kind of laid off of it for so long. It's just not good to have that toxic relationship with your straightener. My hair was also heat trained. Like I would be able to straighten my natural hair in like 20, 30 minutes max. Like I would straighten it once a week, maybe once every two weeks depending on how lazy I was feeling. So my natural hair, you know, it's never been, never been thick. It's never been long, so I'm not gonna sit up here and act like I'm expecting that because I'm not I just want a couple inches. That's all I'm asking for. I'm being very realistic with you know how the results are gonna look Ow. Ow. I'm so tender-headed well, even when I get braids done or when I get like my hair done professionally i have to tell the hairstylist all the time please be gentle please just braid with a soft hand don't hurt me i'm just a big baby this straightener is actually my all-time faves uh amika look how burnt it is because of how much i used it so this is the amika straightener this is actually my second amika straightener i think the first one broke this is for sure my favorite straightener ever I'm straightening my hair with no product in it. I put the product after. I have a little hair serum that I like to use. Like I said, my relationship with my hair. I was never really accepting of wearing my natural hair um, out. You know what I mean? I would always have to straighten it, slick it, wig, weaves. Yeah. Just not good. And I honestly don't, don't think I will ever wear it naturally curly out like it just doesn't look good like i think i need to 
do a lot of masks, like a lot of treatments. Honestly, this video might be a bad idea because I might just have to straighten my hair from now on. <laughs> my hair texture has changed throughout the years. Like I will insert pictures of what it looked like three years ago. If I can find a picture of it in high school when I literally would just straighten it all the time. And I only ever trim my hair when it's straightened. Are you guys the same? Like I feel like I can just see the length. I just know what I'm doing when it's straight. So I'll insert a picture of how it looked last March since I last straightened it. So I'm just trying to see if it grew back healthier and I just want to do like a length check and see how my hair is doing. I hate getting to this part of my hair like right here is where all the tangles and like the driest part of my hair. Shout out to wigs though. If it weren't for wigs, I would be damaging my hair whether it be slicking it, straightening it. This is better, so you can actually see my hair. Like, what, Shoshana? Really, bitch? Really? My hair grew, I trimmed it up to here, so it grew like two inches. <laughs> I'm amped, are you crazy? What the hell? I'm very excited to finish straightening my hair to see how it actually looks. Okay, that strand had some oil on it. I'm gonna move back so you guys can actually see it. My hair has grown. Oh, do you hear all that? Oh, I'm stupid. <sighs> Forgot to spray heat protectant on my hair before I straightened it. <laughs> Whatever, you know what? Honestly, whatever. The damage is already done, literally. And I'm just gonna continue straining my hair. Whatever. Are you coming soon to me? No parking in the bay. So I'ma send a Uber to your place. Is my secret safe? Safe with just you and me. We can leave a trace. This is my favorite mistake. Oh, look in my eyes. Can you find the light? Do you feel the light? Look in my eyes. Do you find the light? Do you feel the light? Look in my eyes. We both know it's wrong, but you're still. There's a lot of flyaways, but that's okay. Thank you for watching me straighten my hair for the first time in a long, long time. And let me just make sure makeup is good because, you know, I've been sweating. Yeah, I do notice a difference in the thickness, definitely in the length, like, for sure. I'll enter the picture of how it looked over here. It was like trimmed it to be about here. If you guys saw me, I was spraying some dry shampoo while I was straight, like after I straightened the pieces in the front because they do get oily. Yeah, I should trim it. Okay, I'm gonna trim my hair. I kind of want to do this though. You know, curl inwards. Doesn't look bad. This is basically how my hair looks, straightening it after a good year. I'm actually very proud of my hair for growing. It's Magic Shampoo Invisible Dry Shampoo. My favorite dry shampoo. Works so good. If my hair looks a bit dry, I will put a serum. Like, I do like this. Um, this is actually a Toronto brand. The Just by Aurea Hair Do. And my fingernails aren't dirty. I just dyed my hair black. So, yeah. So, yeah. I literally have everything in her line. It's really, really good. Even for black hair. I never really had thick hair to begin with. So, I'm not, I'm not, I wasn't expecting thickness. I wasn't expecting hella length. My hair has never been long and thick. So, I'm, I'm okay with this. I'm actually very happy with this. I'm happy. I'm excited. You know, we love a little bit of growth. And I'm gonna keep wearing wigs, to be honest. I, I'm not gonna straighten my natural hair. I just don't have the time, and I don't have the patience, and I don't want to damage it when I can literally just plop on a wig and have the same effect. So I'm gonna continue wearing wigs. Uh, I'm gonna continue straightening my hair maybe every six months. Maybe like twice a year, you know, I'll do a check-in. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video and like the video so that the algorithm can pick up this video and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next upload. Bye!
Oh, 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 oh,